Christopher Alvarez is a student at one of the most prestigious institutions in the world, Columbia University School of Journalism. The graduate student is a reporter, producer, and motivational speaker with over 330,000 followers on Instagram and many more on other platforms. I caught up with him at his queen's home to tell me his success story. Like this. I'm doing it like this. Alvarez was born with an atophoric dysplasia, a genetic severe psychiatric disorder, characterized with disproportionately small ribcage, extreme short limbs, and folds of extra skin on the arms and legs. The 22-year-old has beaten odds to survive longer than was expected. He was expected to live until age 5 and is thus seen as a miracle by many. Born to Colombia immigrant parents, the motivational speaker is a graduate of Adelphi University, Garden City, New York, where he studied and graduated in broadcast journalism. It was the first time we were meeting as classmates of the Master of Science program at Columbia Journalism School, where I am also a student. To Alvarez, joining the towering institution is a dream come true. I'm excited. The walls of his bedroom are decorated with pictures of his family, certificates from several institutions and bodies, while basketball memories and personal accolades are placed where they can easily be spotted. His family has been very supportive of his dreams, often sparring him in times of difficulty. I think my You know, every time that I think something is hard, like he's the one that inspires me to like keep working harder and to try to accomplish my goals. In 2015, he met the Colombian national soccer team. The major highlight of this meet was Alvarez saving a penalty kick from star David Ospina. Disability has not deterred the communicator from living his dream. He is known for raising awareness of several psychological disorders and wants the Comedy Central's daily show host Trevor Noah to support his activism. I met Trevor Noah, who told me today that we met, that he followed me, and that he was inspired by my work as an activist. The activist believes disability is not inability. His rallying call is an end to stigma of the disabled. Discrimination will never stop. And justice there will always be a problem with it. Alvarez has met and worked with many celebrities, including the Colombian singer Balvin. He cites his biggest moment as when he learned that Columbia University's dean, also New York Times journalist Steve Cole, was his professor. Their interactions have so far been online via Zoom due to COVID-19 pandemic. Alvarez savors each moment nonetheless. Alvarez does most of the chores by himself despite his disability. This includes texting, typing, and sending out emails on his own as well as other work in his home office. Reporting from New York City, I'm Remy Bahati.